it the cat what's up youtube family welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here karibu sana don't forget to subscribe share and comment and to my returning subscriber asanteni sana and welcome back guys this is chill spot where we talk about life matters we talk about relationship and different matters that help our life and that help society so guys karibuni sana and today's topic we're going to talk about body shaming i know a lot of people outside there they have been body shamed we have been called names we have been nicknamed names that see see like they are not good names and we have been nicknamed because we we have been nicknamed because of our body structure our skin tones by the way we walk by our walking styles by the way we dressed we dress sorry so guys kindly let's stop body shaming people and I always say, before you go outside there to talk about me, make sure your life is perfect. Very perfect. And you are living a better life than me. It's not good to body shame people. A lot of people outside there, they have low esteem because of body shaming. They are going through depression because of, because of body shaming. Mtu ata aizi, yani hajiamini. Hata akitoka hapo nje ako like watu watasema nini. It's not good. People outside there are living in shadows because of body shaming. Kindly let's stop body shaming. Let's stop body shaming. It's not a good thing. Just imagine your kid in school. It's being he or she is being body shamed at school. Each and every time anakuja nyumbani akilia because of the word body shamed. Ana amani shule because of being body shamed. Like how do you feel as a parent? Like even yani yeah how how do you feel like a parent? A lot of people I'm the I'm one of them. I've ever been body shamed. I know how it feels. You can even hate the whole of your family you can even hate your family your, your yourself even like inafanyanga mtu mpaka you don't have that self confident unakosa hiyo like kujipenda you know that self love unakosa kabisa because of body shaming you you know when we were growing up let me give you my story when i was growing up I was that ka fat girl that ka katoto kazito kamejikulia vizuri which at the at the society what to they see it like this baby is abnormal akona weight mbaya na maybe ni wazazi wake wamemlisha vizuri so I used to be called kanono even in school kanono because most of my friends are slim other babies are slim and my classmates pia walikuwa wa wadogo like they were walikuwa tu na tumuli to petit to petit but nikionekana playing with them it look it looks so weird because of my of my body so they used to call me kanono i used to cry literally cry kabisa because siko napenda hiyo jina because you know mtu akikuita kanono definitely akuiti kwa uzuri anakuita sababu of your body structure now already they have seen you you are kanono so as i grew up i went to high school the same shit happened came back to my life body shamed but since in high school people was were like where akisumebeba where sijui nini which they were not saying it in a good way Unaona? Alafu the funny thing my sisters are slim. I'm the only chubby, chubby one. Which I don't have a problem with that. I learn to accept myself the way I am. 
and love myself more no matter the the talks life must go on we move on regardless so guys we know outside there kuna watu hawana hiyo nguvu they don't have that courage to overcome body shaming so before you go ahead and body shame someone ama before you go ahead and say something negative about someone else make sure you are perfect make sure your life is perfect before you go to that platform that social media in someone's photo to say hey ume add weight hey uko na tumbo kubwa make sure you have that flat tummy make sure you have that skin tone that you want them to have guys like you know there is no way i can take my own picture like nimepiga tu picha yangu nimepost hapo kwa facebook anywhere just for my own fun and then wewe umetoka mali uko mali umetoka with your own i don't know like i don't even know what to call those people umetoka mali umetoka with your own comments i didn't ask you to come and comment on my picture i did not call you to come and comment on my picture wewe tu na kiherehere yako ulitoka mali umetoka uka decide let me come and judge this person Oh ume add weight. Hey hiyo gym hiyo tumbo suende gym kidogo. Mpaka you go and extend to advise them the pills ama the the chemicals that they can take for them to acquire that flat tummy. Excuse me. My life my business, my stomach my business. So guys, like it's not good. Before you going there telling that person hey akisuko mweusi so tumie mkorogo ho akisumekonda so try eating kidogo excuse me you don't know what those people are going through in their lives in fact you are you are adding problems in their life it's not good kabisa like it's not okay na body shaming ayanzangi at like kwa social media it all started that a small thing you see you nicknaming someone at a blacky because hana because he's black or she's black you nicknaming person kanono because she's fat you nicknaming someone kaguru because she, he or she has a problem with his or her walking style ama maybe migu zake ziko na shida that's body shaming and the bible says We were all created by the image and the likeness of God. Guys, you never know. Maybe God looks like me. Maybe God is fat like me. Maybe God is black like me. So guys, let's stop body shaming. It's not a good thing kabisa at all at all. Like I know for the people who have been ever body shamed They know how it feels. They really know how it feels to be body shamed. It makes you feel less of yourself. It makes you unakosa self confidence. Inakufanya unakuwa like unakuwa na low esteem. Now we all know when you have low esteem there is nothing that you can do. It leads even to depression. Jutanza kuona like au fai nobody appreciates you in a society but and i don't really know you know kuna two friends wenye wenye the awananga aibu awananga uh, let me say awana adabu you are out you umeoga vizuri umevako ka dress kako whether mtumba or ulinunua kwa duka you umetoka kwa nyumba ukijua you look good I love all of a sudden people you call friends and come he says aki your dress ina kutoa funny aki imetoa tumbo yako yote ona vile uko na tire guys that's not okay like it's it's not right kabisa if if you are seeing something wrong in in me ama you are seeing there is something wrong with that dress 
just keep it to yourself don't tell me because their comments were meant to be like kuna comments they were meant could you care you know could you care and if you have a problem with my body i'm sorry that's me i can't help you like if you have a problem with my skin my dear that's you i can't help you because this is me and this is where i am and nimejikubali vile niko and we can't do th- anything about it kama niko na manyama nyama huku najipenda na hiyo manyama nyama yangu if i'm black i'm okay that way god created me for a purpose and you are not going to tell me anything about that so guys let's stop body shaming and i'll say this word body shaming until inge kwa vichwa za watu it's not good kabisa it's not okay just put yourself into just put just take this situation like it's you mtoto wako ana body shamingwa shule he or she is called names ana amani like each and every time anakuja shul, nyumbani akilia o oh, aliitwa kanono ho siju ameitwa blacky because of his or her body structure as a parent how do you feel let's be realistic Ju- like how do you feel na hizi vitu zote for someone to have low esteem for someone to end up in depression this is one of the things that lead people mpaka wajinyonge kwa sababu once mtu ameitwa majina ame body shamewa like anaonanga there is no reason for for living tena anaona ana aina haja because society already isha muonyesha you are abnormal like you are not like other people you are not like other kids like this is not the way you are supposed to be that that's how it all started so as a parent imagine mtoto wako akibodishemiwa shule anakuja each and every time akilia she have been called names he have been called names as a parent how do you feel let's be realistic how do you feel so guys let's stop body shaming other people cause at first you don't know what that person is going through secondly you don't know if they are sick you don't know if their bodies are, are healthy but you are there just calling them names wanting them to be what you want them to be which is not possible one thing we need to know i'll never be you you'll never be me we are like even our fingers who are zitoshani that's the way we are and that's the way life is so just accept who you are and learn to live with what you have and for those who have been body shamed don't let people tell you what to do and don't tell, let people control you come on you have hizo manyama nyama za huku you okay the way you are someone will love you with those manyama nyama if you are black don't worry god will, will will bring you someone that will love you the way you are you don't need to apply anything you don't need to apply mkorogo for you to be what people wants to see no just be yourself and for you being yourself we'll find someone that will love you for who you are not to what you are pretending to be ama for what you want to be so like do, do, don't kill yourself for impressing people at oh let me go to gym because i want to have that flat tummy at oh let me do sit ups because i want to have that flat tummy at oh let me watch my diet because i want to acquire that flat tummy my sister you will die you will die acquiring that trying to get that flat tummy that you want okay there are those who are born with flat tummy which is a good thing and it's something good because they were born with it but for us who we don't have them we don't want, we, we can't kill ourselves for us to acquire that flat tummy 
there is someone that ananipenda na hizo manyamanja mazangu akishika anasikia vizuri akishika anasikia amefika in the same way there is someone who wants that kaskini girl that kapetit girl ako sawa na yeye so you don't go calling people bones ama ati nyamanya wao umenona sana it's not okay like it's not right so guys let's stop body shaming people it's not a good thing kabisa kabisa do what you want to be done fanyia mtu kitu unataka ufanyiwe the same way do you know we we are all human beings and uh, we go through a lot of challenges which makes our bodies in a change which makes our body zinakuwa they they react in a different way yani they changes us kabisa kabisa kama ulinipata nikiwa na flat tummy sasa sasa hizi nimepata two kids sina flat tummy niko na taya niko na tumbo utanifanya nini ama ai mimi mwenyewe what am i supposed to do niende nikate hiyo tumbo ama should i go and and swallow those kids tumbo yangu irudi vile ilikuwa excuse us we were all created we were all created fearfully and wonderfully made so if you have a problem with someone's body if you have a problem with someone's walking style if you really have a problem with someone's skin tone please just keep the comment to yourself yeah if you can't talk anything positive about someone just keep them to yourself in fact they don't need those negative po- those negative comments cuz they i i say dika bisa like it doesn't help so guys let's stop body shaming people this is not a good thing to do and before you body shame someone make sure you are 100 100% perfect cuz no one is perfect yeah na kila mtu amekewa let me say if it's in a relationship if you know you don't do chubby girls why should you have one i don't see the reason why even you should mingle with those chubby girls if you love skinny girls go for them there are a lot of them out here but don't start body shaming someone at you umenona hata siku anataka ukue hivyo sijui nini excuse me before you lo- you 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 umpende hakuwa hivyo but this is the results now it's better you learn to live with it accept it ama suit yourself but don't go making people kill themselves feel down upon like feel down upon themselves look down upon themselves because you said something negative about them that's not okay like it's not right at all things happen tumekula vizuri god have blessed us tumepata mwili ulinipata nikiwa mslim thank god i'm healthy nimekula vizuri i'm healthy Instead of you thanking God you have nimekula vizuri I'm healthy at least we can watu wanaweza niangalia you are there telling me aki uko na nyama you go to gym how aki umekonda you try to eat hell no if you're not okay with my body suit yourself that's none of my business kabisa and i don't really know sijui kama you see skinny girls wana kuangatu hapo wanaambia au madem au madem au madem chabi ati akis you try going to to gym ama you watch out your weight na deep down yeye uh, he's just struggling with skinniness yake trying to be like you juu ya ame try kukula everything even hata kama ni kukunywa mafuta ya kupika akuwe kama wewe but since it's something in a human being anataka 
tu kukufanya ufeel down yours ufeel tu uko chini ufeel tu so disappointed ufeel less yourself she has to say that and to the chubby to the chubby girls like why should you tell someone skinny at akisujaribu kukula sijui nini in real sense pia ana struggle kukua kama wewe to maintain that body so guys do what makes you happy if you're okay with naizo manyama nyama well and good if you're okay with that kaflat tummy of yours well and good if uko you are skinny that the way you are you don't have ass you don't have boobs it's okay don't allow someone to to tell what to tell you what you should be to tell you what you're supposed to be or what you're supposed to look like no don't allow someone to do that cuz once umemwala anze kukwambia ati ho hizo tire zako ni kubwa sana ho sijui you need to have a flat tummy my dear you won't go far like i'm tako mnasaidiana at the end of the day utajipata kwa depression at the end of the day utapata lo, uko, uko like uko na low esteem at the end of the day utajipata peke yako even you don't have friends you don't go out anymore sasa utakuwa life yako ni ya kujifungia because mentality yako umeeka oh i'm shapeless i can't find someone to love me oh sijui a lot of things at how will people say and let me tell you once you are doing something because ukifanya kitu usikuwe na ile mentality watu watafanya ni ati watasema nini their opinions aimati kwa maisha yako it's all about you it's all about your life see our life at the end of the day they will talk at the end of the day they will say skin tone yako ni mbaya at the end of the day watasema they will say a lot of things au na walking style mzuri au juu kuva you have a shapeless body you have a bad skin or you have a like your skin is so you are so black in color but at the end of the day you'll never see them coming maybe with a mkorogo akwambie my sister my brother jipake you will look good ama usikie mtu amekwambia let me take you to the gym nikutengeneze mwili yako ikuwe perfect they will never do that at the end of the day they will be just there laughing at you at ukifika hiyo point of, depre- of depression of depression hakuna kitu atakusaidia you will never see them but my show inaendelea yako ime stop because of someone else no it doesn't work like that do what makes you happy if your body is like that be happy with it dress good look good go out there have fun we only live once once you make it someone will say what so do what will people see me no you never go in fact let me tell you you see that time when you are saying at him at ho niko na mataya sijui nini nini let me tell you ukitembea huko nje kwa streets ukitembea huko nje kwa cbd Hakunanga mtu hata anaonezo taya zako zenye unasema uko nazo zenye unaambiwa uko nazo hakuna mtu anaonanga ati hiyo kala yako ni mbaya nobody cares hakuna mtu anaonanga hiyo walking style yako nobody really cares but since uliambiwa na mtu you don't look good oh sijui umenona sijui oh umekonda sana sijui nini definitely that will stick up here and i tawai talker so utakuwa na always negativity about yourself which is not a good thing let me tell you something when i was in high school actually i'm the i was the only girl with nyash like let me say big nyash and you know big nyash you know what i mean for those who are in social media they have followed me they know how i look so i had a problem with that cuz each time nilikuwa naulizwa na watu hey umejipaka nini unatumia nga nini so i'm like them mimi ata i don't know what you guys are talking about i grew up niki nikajipata hivi nikakuwa mkubwa nikiwa hivi 
So I don't know what you people you want me to tell you. It's ilifika mahali mpaka nikiwa high school. I felt like I don't want to kusoma tena. And me nilienda shule ya mixed school. Since I was so innocent, si the utapata comments negative zingine upate positive. Si kuwa naelewa, but it took it ilini ilinifanya mpaka nikakuwa so disappointed si kuwa nataka kusoma tena. But with time ilibidi niende kwa school psychologist cuz she was my friend tukaongea na yeye nikamwambia how i feel na nikamwambia me don't want to talk to go to school uh, to to stay in this school tena but after after tume tumeongea akanifunza how to love myself because akanionyesha how a lot of people outside here are are willing to do a lot of things are willing to take chemicals into their body to acquire what i have but me i was given freely by god so since then i loved i i nika nika nikajua kujipenda na kujikubali na nikajua i'm not different it's just being blessed and it's beauty we are all blessed in different ways of beauty kuna wale wako na nywele refu kuna wale hawana kuna those who have a very good skin a baby face skin kuna wale hawana but you can't judge them that's how they were created and we can't do anything about it all we can do is to love them and show them they are wonderfully and fearfully made before the eyes of the lord so guys na kama ninge ningekubali kusikia what people were telling me ati ya um, msijui nini 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 singekuwa hapa today maybe i could be somewhere else living in shadows because taki watu waone what what's really happening in into my like what i look like so guys even as a ukiwa mzima as ukiwa mtu mkubwa hata watu wazima wana body shame other people mtu mzima like body shaming is all over in our society i don't know i don't know what to say like but guys let's stop body shaming other people if i have big nyash says i have big nyash i'm okay the way i am now if you have a problem with my nyash suit yourself Usiniambie I have a problem with your nyash sijui nini punguza sijui nini I'm okay the way I am Na sijai kujua nikakwambia nimekosa trouser nimekosa panty ama nimekosa nguo because I'm this big Hell no Guys do you know how many people outside there are taking like they are taking chemicals they are taking pills for them to have a body body enye anataka kuwa nayo it's not easy na the the only thing you can do to yourself ni kujikubali and never lower yourself at because someone told you uko na tumbo so kana niko na tumbo shida iko wapi mwanamke ni tita to let me tell you titi tako na tumbo So don't allow someone to let you down because that you gonna you have big boobs, you have big stomachs, you gonna matayas, you gonna big ass. Excuse me. No. So let's stop body shaming people. And before you body shame someone, make sure you are 100%. You are 100% perfect. So guys hope you have enjoyed this video and to advice of the day don't allow anybody call you names because at your your body structure don't allow someone let you down because of the way you look don't allow someone call you names because of the way you walk or the way you dress no don't allow that in fact I don't even know what to say but don't allow yani let them mtu akikwambia ni mnono uko mnono god i don't even know what to say 
but please do, don't allow that like don't in short don't allow negative energy into your life because it will destroy you completely tell them to keep their comment to yourself you don't need them you are just okay the way you are and if they have a problem with their body that's not your problem it's their problem so yeah so guys i don't have anything to say actually i'm very sorry if i sounded so bitter because it's not right i hate it i really hate it i don't like it kabisa kabisa but hope this video will help someone out there someone that is suffering from body shaming yeah and kindly let's stop body shaming it's not a good thing to do so guys this have been chill spot i don't have anything else to say so yeah don't don't forget to subscribe share and comment until we meet again peace